Konnichiwa, Americans. Jericho Green here with you once again. And Democratic frontrunner for the 2020 election, Joe Sniff Your Kids Biden, or I like to call him his by his Latin name, Bidenus Pervertus. He unveiled a five t -t 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 trillion dollar plan to combat, you guessed it, climate change. <laughs> When are they going to stop with this silly shit? His plan has us completely weaned off of fossil fuel by 2050. Now, I don't know who to listen to. Beta male O'Rourke, Francis, he's telling me the world's going to end in 10 years if we don't do something. Loco Cortez. Okay, you motherfuckers. Oh, whoa. It's so polluted. She got my fucking baby, man. So, Loco Cortez is telling me that the world's going to end in 12. Now, if my public school education does not fail me, 2050 is farther away than 10 or 12 years. Anyway, JoJo wants to take was it almost two trillion in taxpayer dollars and the rest will come from the private sector aka us to combat climate change now nobody is able to answer this fucking question for me where does the money go now he's saying if he's elected he will immediately immediately put us back in that bullshit Paris Accord. Well, and what Obama say? Oh, uh, we are the only country who pulled out of the Paris Accord. And there's a lot of countries in the world and we're the only one. That's right, you jobless bitch. That's right, little spoon. Because you know when him and, and Michelle Obama spoon, he's definitely the little spoon. So... He wants to put us back in this bullshit Paris Accord. Where does the money go? Do they take the money and like bury it in the ground? What was that? What was the that plant's name in Rocky Horror Show? I can't. I, it's at the tip of my tongue. But is the Earth going? Feed me. So we bury the money. Does the Earth like swallow it and burp after? And like you you are okay for now bring me more money in 30 days do we fly the money into space and send it into the sun like where does the money go you can't fix the earth with money and if anything you need to be pushing that shit on other countries like India China the two biggest polluters on our planet America is the cleanest country on earth. I know people will tell you, no, it's Sweden, it's Norway, and Birgen Forgen Giergen. No, we are. When I was a kid, I think when I was probably in junior high school, maybe high school, they had this campaign, recycle, reduce, reuse. So we've been recycling. We've had two trash cans in front of our house. We've done beach cleanups. We take the Dawn dish soap and we wash the little duckies and birdies when there's an oil spill. We are a clean country. Not like some other countries where people piss and shit in the street and there's piles of trash. No, wait a minute. I just described San Francisco. Never mind. Aside from that shithole, America is a clean country. Our money is not going to fix anything. Do you know how much of our society is based on fossil fuel? Electricity, your cars, industry. What the fuck are, you, are we going to do without fossil fuel? We're all supposed to put one of those big ass windmills in our front yard and cover our house in solar panels? All right, you're going to pay for that shit? No, we are. But Elizabeth Warren, a couple other ones rolled out plans. Because remember, it's the choir party. <clears throat> me, 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 me. 
they're all saying the same shit, but they all have different faces, but it's the same fucking message. People were saying, Joe, your plan isn't bold enough. So that's why he came out with this shit. Bold, by that they mean extreme. Nobody believes that shit. Nobody believes the world is going to end. Nobody believes we're in danger. We're in peril. It's an existential threat. Shut the fuck up. Check out that guy, what's his name, Dan Pena? He explains it very well. If it was such an existential threat, and our lives were in such danger, and the world's going to end soon, then why are banks giving mortgages? How long is a mortgage? 20, 30 years? You think they would sell, they would give away or sell a house? Or give out a mortgage? If the fucking earth was going to end in 10 to 12 years? Who is believing this bullshit? And of course all the other countries want us in the Paris Accord. We're the only motherfuckers with any money. We're paying the damn tab. Of course they want to invite us out to dinner. We're going to pay for it. Trump said, hell no we're not. Now I know you have Barry's bitch ass in the bathroom shoving him against the wall, emptying his pockets. Like the little bitch that he is. Trump's not that. You ain't taking our money. We've been suckers for too long. Remember the old cartoons where they would fool one of the main characters and they'd look at the camera and their head would turn into a sucker and it would say sucker on it? That's us. Or when the same thing would happen and the, the they would turn into a donkey and it would say jackass, that was us. Not anymore. Fuck you and your climate change. And if climate change is taking place, number one, we didn't fucking cause it. We are not that significant. We are a flea on a dog's back. And as soon as that dog decides to scratch us off, we are dead. When that BP oil spill happened, at the height, when it was the oil was just pumping out, it was one part oil to five billion parts water. That's like taking an eyedropper of some food coloring and putting one drop in a fucking swimming pool. It meant nothing. We mean nothing to this planet. We ain't shit. But they don't want you to believe that. They want you to believe that we are such a fucking parasite to the earth that we need your money. Okay, for what? And who's it going to? And what the fuck are you going to do with it? Nothing. God, man, these fools. You, and how many of these clowns are running? I just saw something uh, yesterday about some convention they had in San Francisco with all these presidential candidates. I never even heard of these fucking clowns. Who the fuck are these people? But I'll tell you what, I'll tell you what I do know. They want our money for some bullshit to go into their pockets. Somebody's got to pay the families off of these dead hookers that they keep killing on these weird ass drug induced weekends that they go on. Fucking clowns. Man, let me get up out of here. People, you know how it goes. I try to be done with the left, but they just won't let me. Please subscribe, hit the notification bell. Also, utilize the PayPal and Teespring links to get your green gear. I am Jericho Green. Man, I'm out.